Hey, good evening. So I will tell you right now we are downtown Cincinnati at the Serpentine Wall and take a look at the water right here. This is supposed to be a parking lot where cars are able to be at, but obviously it is closed. Take a look at this no parking sign that's about halfway underneath the water and you can see where parts of this wall is underneath that water. So this is all due to some of those flooding concerns you've been seeing. There's a pretty detailed account for each level. Uh, we're almost at 47 feet and the National Weather Service says that this level we can see impacts to Coney Island and the PNC Pavilion. We'll see some flooding as well, which is actually designed to flood, by the way. And at 48 feet, California, Ohio starts seeing flooding as well. And at 53 feet, which is where we're projected to reach the access road at Covington Landing floods. Anderson Township could see some flooding as well, and along with some low lying areas in New Richmond. Front Street Cafe owner Robert Lees in New Richmond says he is confident this weekend's flood, though, won't be as bad as years past. Last year, uh, the water got to about that same level, maybe a little bit higher. The year before, um, it, it got up to 60 feet in Cincinnati, about 59 feet here. And uh, that did cause some flooding in the lower lying uh, areas of our village. All right, and Friday, the Ohio River will reach the minor stage, and then by Saturday, it is expected to crest and get this. Uh, the highest was 80 feet back in 1937. We will not be anywhere near that at all, but still got a couple long days left to go in this. Live in Cincinnati, Raven Richard, WCPO 9 News.